Hi guys, greetings of the day. Myself Vijayta Vardhan and in this present video lecture session I am going to show, show you a solution on projection of plane surfaces. And an example problem is like this. A hexagonal lamina of size 25 mm rests on one of its sides on VP. The lamina makes 45 degree to VP and the side on which it rests makes 45 degree to HP. Draw its projections. According to the given conditions, go to applications, macros, run macro, select inside polygon, click on open, select the flat line and the flat length is supposed to be taken as 25 according to the given condition and in hexagon there are 6 edges, click on the apply relationship, press the cursor anywhere on the screen so that hexagon is going to be appeared. Once the hexagon is appeared, select this hexagon and position it in a VP and it is resting on a side, so this is a side resting and then go to a line command with respect to a line thickness as 0.13 one can draw the projectors to get the required front view sorry required top view in the first stage now here one can see that the intersection symbol has appeared so the line angle has been changed to a different angle so that will uh, redraw the line once again that is a horizontal line sorry vertical line has been generated then using a line command again with a thickness of 0.15 draw this line as a split line so that it is going to helpful for the next stage then make use of the smart dimension command show that the size of the hexagon is 25 millimeter and then using the text command name the respective corners so i will name this corner as a dash this corner as b dash and this corner as c dash this corner as d dash and this corner as e dash and then accordingly this corner is going to be named as f dash according to that in the top view we have to complete the namings this is going to be a and f and b and e b and e and then so here we got it uh, v so let me make it as b e and then we have c and d now we'll make a c and d now the lamina makes 45 degree to vp now one has to select the top view go to a command called as uh, move move with respect to a and a has to be positioned properly on the xy line and after which go to a command called as rotate a is on the xy line and b is supposed or c is supposed to be inclined at an angle of 45 degree so set the angle of rotation as 45 degree then make use of angle between command show that the angle between these two lines are supposed to be 45 degree and after which using a line command with a thickness of 0.13 draw the projectors to get the front view now c and d is going to be projected first and then so a and f is going to be projected so that the four projectors are drawn next b and e is there so we'll connect b to b and then b we have e so we shall draw the projector to e now one can say that the projectors is completed in all aspects go to the text command name the corners what we have got the projectors like a dash b dash c dash d dash then e dash and finally this is going to be the f dash then using a line command with a thickness of 0.5 millimeter one has to complete the front view properly using the line command with a thickness of 0.5 millimeter now once it is done the second stage construction is completed and all aspects as per the given conditions the resting side is inclined to 45 degree to hp the resting side is af the length of af in both the stages remains as 25 so the 25 is directly drawn on the 45 degree line because there are the true lens true lens will be always drawn on true angles so one has to construct a uh, inclined line now the inclination of this line is supposed to be taken as 45 degree so now set the angle as 45 degree then select the front view then after selecting the front view go to a command called as move move with respect to a dash a dash is supposed to be placed on the 45 degree line then go to rotate command rotate in such a way that a is on the xy line f is going to appear on the xy line like this now the rotation is also completed as per the condition given then using a line command with the thickness of 0.13 with the right extreme corner that is d is connected to d properly 
so we will connect uh, D and along with D we have C so we will complete the C projector also then we have E E and B is together so now to avoid confusions let the angle be given as 90 degree so let us connect uh, E properly and along with E we have B so we will get the position of B and AF is on the XY line so we will project A and EF on the XY lines properly now after drawing these things make use of the text command name the respective corner this corner is going to be named as A and this corner is going to be named as B and this as C this as D this as E and this is going to be the corner F and once all the uh, namings were given using the line command with a thickness of 0.5 millimeter join the lines a to b b to c c to d d to e e to f back to a now this completes the constructions as per the given conditions and if you have any doubts to solve this problem please feel free to call me at this number now one can say that the problem is completed and also please do subscribe to my youtube channel and also share this video to all your first year engineering students once again thanks for watching my video thank you guys